Look, I'm one of these guys that say we should be better than three. Um, Are we, though? There's a lot going on. There's a lot going on right now. The economy still looks sloppy to me. When you look at kind of the year-over-year -year changes, it's really a mixed bag. We're seeing a resurgence right now in primary metals. We're seeing a resurgence a bit in, in automotive, but a lot of the automotive is due to reaction to uh, Harvey and Irma, right? Uh, when I think about inflation, it's persistently low. And so I think there's a lot of optimism if you look at those kinds of how do people feel statistics. Those look good, but I'll bet you a lot of that is predicated on a belief that there's going to be tax reform. If there's tax reform, I think this economy has a chance to really do well. How were your, uh, you, you would say your numbers were in line with expectations or better? Southern Company's numbers? Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, look, uh, w w uh, on an X item basis, uh, we're a buck 12 for the quarter, which beats our, uh, our estimate seven. and yeah. it beats our consensus. Uh, and we've done really well. We had an exceedingly mild weather for the whole year, really. For the quarter, it was 10 cents mild. And what we've done is been able to make that up on really uh, kind of expense management, but not just cutting costs, modernizing the company, actually improving efficiency, reliability, and customer service through uh, investments largely in technology. So how will the, this latest sort of uptrend in, in crude, how will that affect your result? It, does the whole energy complex, do you, your margins, I mean, do you do, you do better when, when you make more money, when you charge more for stuff? Southern Company specifically is reasonably indifferent to fuel prices. In other words, oil, we have yeah. fuel clauses throughout our system to where we pass those through at cost, so we don't make money up or down. Uh, the resurgence in crude, though, has uh, had an effect in primary metals. In other words, people are committing to more pipelines, et cetera. They believe that prices will be stable uh, for a longer period of time. So primary metals is up largely in pipeline development. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.